Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You are watching The Real Coley. Can we have like a moment for the skin? Because what? What? If you haven't seen my skincare favorites, please go check that out. Click the link up here and it will also be linked down below. Did y'all miss me? Did y'all miss me? I miss giving y'all tips and tricks for the girls with the locks. Today, I am showing you all how to style your locks without a retwist on medium to long ish hair i guess i've done this before when i did my lock bob so my hair was like maybe to my shoulders above my shoulders and i wanted to do a few like short hairstyles for locks so if you haven't seen that make sure you check out that video and yeah keep watching make sure to like comment and subscribe and let's get into the video first things first let's spritz our hair with some water water makes your hair very like soft malleable so that it's easy to style so the first style would be a middle part bust down black wig middle part bust down okay yes she's very much giving and this is why i use the water because the water helps my locks to like stay down and stay flat so you can do a little tuck behind the ear action you can pin it so it stays and then you can add you know a little curly if you have one middle part bust down black unit per okay next style is going to be an updo ish kind of thing I'm going to grab my jumbo scrunchie you can find these in my description box And I am just going to bun it up real quick, real cute. Take my curlies down. It's quick, it's not a pineapple, it's not a bun. It's a bunapple. Bunapple. So the next style would literally just be like pulling out a few locks from the bun apple. And you can choose to retwist the front locks if you want to, to make it look a bit neater. This is like a rendition of like a messy bun, but with locks. Some hair hanging down. We always love to frame the face. And I love a good satin scrunchie because I'm not for my hair getting like tangled and being dried out by any other fabric so i love to keep a satin scrunchie on me okay and you can find these in the description box check it out i have jumbo ones and then we have some small ones right. next style doesn't require much except a little flip over action um like so you can flip it over this way, you can flip it over that way. This is like my go-to side, but I kind of am fucking with this side now. Yes. You can have the part if you want to, but who got time for that, baby? Lots of convenience. You ain't even gotta do that. Go in and define your part if you want. I'm not gonna do it for the video, but in real life, I probably would make sure this part is super straight. I'm just gonna take a few that I have flipped over and I'm going to tuck underneath the rest of the hair and pin it with some bobby pins. And I love like a good deep swoop, y'all. Like when I used to have my loose natural hair, I stay with a deep swoop. Now that that is pinned, I'm going to section my hair into two sections straight down the middle. I'm gonna do two like high ponytails. 
oh this is so cute why have i never actually worn this outside it's given like bubbles i don't know why but it makes me feel like bubbles from powerpuff girls okay and for the next style it just requires you to take down the ponytail swoop back a little bit you can use a brush and smooth out the hair for a sleeker look which is what i usually do but for the sake of the video and the sake of time i'm just going to not do that so here we are with that and we're just gonna do a low pony You can do a sleek pony without having to brush too much or without having to add gel. Like this, this is quick and easy, y'all. Quick and easy. We have a cute low side ponytail, no tension. I literally wrapped the scrunchie around one time, no gel. If you're looking for a little razzle dazzle, you can go ahead and add a satin scrunchie. All right, the next thing, super simple. I would recommend using a large headband and not a regular scrunchie. And you're just going to take the hair into a low pony and then go once more. But this time, don't go all the way through. Only go like halfway through. And here you have a cute little bun situation. This is another go-to. So the next style, you would just put a scrunchie, not a scrunchie, you will put a scarf and you know I need my Chanel. Psych, this ain't fucking Chanel, baby. This is from the beauty supply store and we're just gonna make it work. So we're gonna slightly put it over our bang we could tie like this or we could um leave the strings down which i might do <laughs> so the next style is going to be like a crown bantu knot so i just twist well you y'all should know how to do a bantu knot then i take my rubber bands and i just rubber band that we have this side done and we're just gonna go ahead and grab a you so we can have four in the front make sure that they're evenly you know spaced you don't want to have like one all the way back here really just want to make sure like the bantu knots are at an even height and that they look symmetrical and then on to the last for you all right so this is the next style it gives like a crown-esque type of feel you could do as many as you want as small or as big as you want i think this is so cute the next style is going to be a ponytail with bantu knot crown and i am gonna leave one lock down which lock do i like to leave down this one And then you could even add like a bead or something on here or even a shell. Let me see if I could get this on here. So this is the final look. It's giving what it needs to give. If you guys wanna check out my edge tutorial, be sure to click here. I hope these were some great, like no retwist hairstyles, low tension styles. Those are all the styles I could think of right now. If I have any more, I will definitely post them. Be sure to check the description box for all the links to everything listed in the video. Be sure to tag me if you use any of these styles. Let me know that you've watched this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe and drop a comment bye Mwah. love you guys Baby boy, you stay on my mind.